Alright guys, so tools you're going to need to do the airbags. Um, if you can get a ratcheting wrench, that would be awesome. Um, I'd recommend a ratchet wrench, 9 sixteenths. You're going to need a 6mm Allen wrench. Um, if you can get um, an Allen wrench socket or an Allen socket, whatever you want to call this. Six millimeter, that works awesome. And if you want to get an impact, a little three eighths inch impact, nine sixteenths deep, that works good um, to do the bottom, to do the side bolts. Um, doesn't really work that great. I, that's why uh, I used a ratchet wrench just to put it on. Um, so yeah, I had a couple issues with mine because it already had airbags on it previous by the previous owner and I had to take that bracketry off so I ended up having to use a big torque big impact <clears throat> um and you do need a torque wrench apparently I didn't use a torque wrench because uh I'm awesome and I'm cool and if you're cool and awesome you don't need a torque wrench but anyway um, but yeah, for the most part, that's pretty much all you need. 9 sixteenths, 6 millimeter Allen wrench, 9 sixteenths wrench it, 9 sixteenths socket. Um, some type of way to cut it. Uh, it recommends a razor knife, not scissors, because scissors crush it, and when the scissors cut, they, they cut to an angle. Um, but anyway, razor knife, 9 sixteenths wrench, ratchet wrench. Whatever you can get, um, wire cutters for the zip ties, uh, 9 sixteenths deep socket, and you'll need a, I believe it's a half inch for the valve stem to tighten those. This is what I used. You don't have to use one of these. That's just what I used because I have them. Um, and I didn't want to torque on them too much, so hand torque works great anyway so here's the video all right guys welcome back half fast 719 gonna be installing these on the dodge you can see it says dodge ram 2500 3500 kit number seven five seven two nine five um five seven two nine seven 88295-88297-88295 and we got the kit 8829F so 8829 what is going on here why can't 88295F which is 88295 it's one of those it's the middle one the middle one my finger don't reach that far. Anyway, I'm going to go through the instructions real quick. Probably not with you guys. So, I've got three choices. This is just the standard one, zinc, zinc plate. This is the one I got, the ultimate. And then this is the ultimate plus, comes with steel braided lines, which, blah, whatever. Um, anyway, there's the components. That's how it's supposed to look. Installed. Tools, um, tool list, blah, 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 jack the truck up, removing the joust bumper, mine are already removed, um, but I'm gonna flip through this really quick, read some junk, read some stuff, and, uh, basically just get under there and install it, so... I'll just I'll just show you my truck real quick. Ouch. Anyway, this is my mega cab. You can see I already have Schrader valves out here. Right there. Boy, let me get under the truck. Oh. Oh. Almost lost my glasses. Anyway, you can see. I have red lines already going. 
All right, I don't know where I was at. Some kid wanting to make some money for me to vote or something to that effect. Told him I'll vote. I don't get involved in politics. Anyway, I have lines. They already installed. It looks like a Firestone kit. Looks like it was already here. So what I gotta do is I just gotta take this bracketry off here, bracketry off over there, and uh, mine's gonna be a little more labor intense, I guess you could say. Ugh. Ugh. I am not using these lines. If you just saw how much dirt came out of there. So I'm gonna have to pull these lines out. Um, what's this line at? Whoa. Close my eyes. Oh man. Oh man, you see how much dirt's coming out of that? <laughs> okay. I'm not using these lines. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut all these zip ties off camera obviously we cut all those and uh, yeah just start getting into it not sure how much you guys will see how much I'll show you but uh, yeah basically I just need to take these Allen's out cut all the zip ties and uh, basically I just gotta remove these lines all the way back to here it's pinched anyway. Oh man. DEF, look at that. Yeah, gotta love DEF. That's what you guys are breathing. That's what America and people are breathing. All this crap. All this white toxic stuff because of DEF. But it's good for your environment. Shut up. So I don't get into politics. Alright guys, I'm going to just start getting into it. Don't know how much you'll see, like I said. But, um, yeah. I might just throw them on and call good. And then just show you guys what I did. Alright. Uh, I'll be back. Or I'll be back. Well guys, I'm kind of at a standstill. So I assembled these. So those brackets I have to install on the truck but these bolts oh I cannot get these allen bolts out so I've already twisted one allen wrench I'm just trying to get under here real quick with an impact maybe let's see I sprayed the top of them with WD-40 these bolts was it Allen set screws? They will not budge at all. As you can see, I have the other one here, so I'm gonna try sticking an impact to it. And uh, yeah, let's see. Let's see what we got. Let's see where I can set you. That might work, might not. Let's see if I can get in here. And of course not. Maybe the front one. I don't want to run an extension or nothing.
I'm gonna get a bigger one. And I'll probably break that socket. I'll be back. I don't know if you guys will be able to see it or not. But uh, not going anywhere. Biggins. Still recording? Sure am. Alright, good. Okay, we're gonna break that little socket. But, whatever. Suck it! My brother for the wind again. Man, oh, this thing's hot. Got it out, so they are Loctite. Man, right. They do have Loctite on them, so I'm going to heat them with a torch. And uh, see if I can't loosen that Loctite up and zip them all out with the big, with the big in. <coughs> oh, I'll be back. All right, guys. Got the airbags just... Mocked up in here. Ended up getting all those bolts out. A little heat and a big impact. So, got it in here. So now I just need to get the brackets. And, uh, uh, I gotta loosen these bolts. Because I don't read the instructions. It says leave these loose until you get it all in there. And, um, get it all in there centered. And then you can run it. How you want it? It says you're supposed to have it like tilted or something stupid. I don't know why. I don't know why you wouldn't want it just straight up and down since I don't know. I didn't build it. So anyway, we'll get brackets, put it all in, and then I'll probably just run all the wiring or the hoses, and uh, yeah, go from there. So I'll be back. All right. It's the next morning. Oh, got her all done. Zoom in one handed. Airbag. Airbag. Ended up having to use a different exhaust clamp. We got the lines ran. <clears throat> I'm gonna buy a, a T. So that um, I can just run them both off of one. And then this way, if an airbag blows out, it won't be all lopsided. And that's the stupid heat shield. But we're all in. We're holding pressure. I'm gonna go for a drive. I'm gonna go for a drive. They got eight pounds. I'm gonna go pick up my trailer, and then possibly pick up a parts tractor <clears throat> little Yanmar parts tractor for my tractor <clears throat> so waiting for the guy to message me but more than likely I'm probably gonna go get my trailer anyway I'm gonna leave here once I have some food cooked and uh, come home start installing windows and hopefully uh, kid will come Look at my, uh, whatever that's called, breaker box, breaker panel, about upgrading it to a newer, bigger, newer, bigger one. So anyway, I'm going to go pick up the trailer and everything. See you guys on the next video. I don't know what the next video will be. Maybe doing fork seals. There's a lot of.
videos out there doing fork seals. <clears throat> I got a lot of parts to put on. I want to change the oil in it. I think my brother-in-law said he just changed it, but you guys know me. I like to do it just to know. Um, tools you will need for the... Eh, I'll, I'll do another video. Do it in the intro. But anyway, alright guys. Thanks for watching. Subscribe. Stay tuned for the next video. Later.